almost a day and a half since I dropped off the trail, the, the wheels. Pick it up the wheels now and we're gonna drop off to Limited's Auto Lab so he can uh, ceramic coat it. I just wanna give that extra protection to it. And then once he's done, we're gonna put it in the car. Simple like that, doesn't get any, any better. All right, I got the wheels and it's nasty outside. Always when I'm gonna do something with a car, it's nasty, so just my life. Limited is out of lab, here we go. Second home, Limited is out of lab. Oh man, I can't, dude, I feel my life is all over the place. And of course, they have cars all over here. Um, but the reason why I want to ceramic coat this wheel is just because it's a brand new wheel and I'm saying like, um, doesn't make sense to uh, not ceramic coat something that's brand new and that I spend money on it and so on and so forth. So... Tomorrow. <laughs> I feel bad because, of course for you guys, those seconds, but for me, it's kind of day four of this upload because I'm picking up the wheels today and we have a guest, special guest, Mia. She's riding with me. I feel bad, you know, she's always home. Every time you come in the garage, I think you guys can hear in my vlogs that she's like barking a lot. So she loves to be there with me, but she's not as behaved as she should. So that's why I don't take her to the drive without a leash uh, because she's gonna run away, unfortunately. But she's here more or less and we are getting back to Limitless Outer Lab to pick it up with the new wheels for the car! That's Junior's new wrap. I'm not sure if he wants me to show this, but whatever. What's up, dude? How are you, man? How's the clutch? Good, we're golden. We're done. Junior, did that help you at all? <laughs> I finished it, I drove it, I brought it back, said the pedal's way f***ing high, I said get in it and drive it, him and Ali took off, came back an hour later, he goes, the pedal's too high! <laughs> Fix it! <laughs> but it's amazing, it's a racing clutch. Uh-huh. That much? It only moves that much. It's just like... Cool. You know, we look, I looked at the first one you handed me really good, yeah. no marks good, but he found one, and I tell you exactly what happened. It was the first one, it was all three. Three of them are perfect, not a mark. The they probably one. screwed up the well, first one. Well, it was one. a kid, probably a younger guy, didn't know if you were on the machine, it slipped. Because that's exactly what happens. If it slips on the machine, the bar. Which one it is? Is the front right? one? One of the fronts. Those, uh, those two, one of those two. Uh, Here. Yes. Uh, actually, and there was a worse spot. Was it that one or was it this one? The roll them out. It looked worse when he had it laying flat. Um, so yeah, it's, it's, this is the one. It's, it's, probably it's, not, that it's one. not that bad, but I called a guy. Point is, yeah, it's, I think it's here though. Yeah, now it's, it gets you worse. Yeah. yeah, and they definitely touch it up with paint because when, cause for him, the ceramic, he cleans with alcohol, uh -huh. and when he cleaned with alcohol, it, it, came took out. The, it took the black paint off. So, you know, I mean, we you touch it up with just a little gloss black paint. It, I, I called a guy, he's like, okay, I'll refund you like $50. All right. So, but and I was like, you should have to tell me, you know what I'm saying? Like, just say. Right. Well, and like I said, his tech did it, panic, got him or got someone that had a little more experience because the other three are flawless, not a mark. Uh, but they look good though. Oh, yeah. I mean, after he cleaned it up. All right, we finally got home. We're gonna put this bad boys on. And I don't know how much you could see at the shop, but look at those babies, boy. Those are their rears and those are the fronts. So I'm just gonna put you guys on the, like a time lapse kind of thing, and I'm gonna throw that in, the and that's it. Look at how the black is like glossy. Can't wait to put that on. So let's get the quick check in place, and that's it. I have to say though, have the quick jack would be so much easier. If I had like a regular jack, it would be a pain. So I'll take all the wheels off, and we're gonna get the new ones in. outside I had no choice uh, sorry to cut you guys but in the garage the lighting was just not doing 
And man, what a accomplishment. You guys ready to see my brand new, and now I can say it's like a brand new car since I got it. And well, here we go. My brand new C701 wheels on my base Corvette. that car what do you guys <laughs> I cannot stop smiling though look at that look at that car dude please tell me that you like there is no way you don't like this look at the house sits man that's crazy <laughs> that is crazy dude look at that wheel man I think I did a good choice going with the C701 to be honest, when that wheel came out, I wasn't that fan. But now, dude, look at that. Oh my gosh, look at how this car sits though. Look at that. Look at that. So I went up, as you guys know, I went up uh, a size in the back and also in the front. The back is 305 20s, 255 19s in the front. Uh, those are Continental Super Sport uh, in both front and rear. And those are the C701. I still have spacers on though. That's how, you know, how uh, the fitment it is. It's not bad at all. It's not bad at all. And it's it's funny how the car looks wider. So if you look at the, the side, it looks so much wider though. That's crazy, dude. Dude, man. Let me know what you guys think about this. If it was a good choice, all the black and red going on. One thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wrap the roof in the halo. So, but dude, oh my gosh, this thing looks awesome. I hope you guys like it. Let me know in the description below. All right, boys, sorry. I lost the footage when I was doing the outro. So that's why we are back in the garage and that's how she sit in the garage. What do you think, huh? Yeah, that was that was probably the first mod I want to do uh, to this car, but I hold it. I hold it until the last time because you know you cannot go cheap, especially when you or talk about tires in a you know car the you know with a lot of horsepower for a for a street or regular street, and that's why I you know people were giving me hard time to blast deep my old wheels, but it was just like a way to figure out while I was working towards this wheel. I always wanted these wheels and I finally got it. And that's how she's sitting here in the garage. So I'm so happy so far and I hope you guys enjoy it too. One thing I forgot to mention, it's the winner for the giveaway, which I asked you guys how much horsepower she would make it. You guys guessed, uh, I picked the closest one, which was Tim. He said 427 and she put it down 422. So he was the closer one. I contact him already and I'm gonna send like a hard work force hat and t shirt for him. So congratulations, team, and I hope you guys enjoy this upload. Let me know what you think about the new wheels if you expect to come out this nice or not. But hey, I'm enjoy. Cannot wait to take this to the first event. I hope you guys enjoy, and as always, never forget, enjoy your life and work hard for it.